We begin the 9 a.m. news hour with new video of the devastating fire in Moab. Take a look at all that smoke. This video comes from a viewer and look at the size of that fire right near homes. Firefighters still keeping an eye on hot spots this morning. Investigators are looking into what caused the fire. And destroyed eight homes already and two garages. Fox 13's Kirsten Nunez joins us live from the neighborhood. She's been talking to those affected by the fire. Good morning, Kirsten. Good morning, Dan and Carrie. You know, we talk about that new video of the flames that we just saw. Now we're at the different side of Patch Creek, having a new angle of the damage that all those flames caused. You can see this home. This is one of eight homes that we're told have been destroyed. Now we know two garages have been destroyed as well as a shop. Now, this is still setting in for this small community. They're really banding together during this tragedy, but it's been less than 24 hours since the flames took over this area and crews say the wind and dry conditions made it so the fire quickly got out of control, destroying those eight homes and the other structures. Agencies here in Moab and surrounding areas quickly responded, making it so the fire didn't spread and around 100 people were evacuated. Now crews spent most of the night mopping up several hot spots and those hot spots are still continuing to pop up now into the nine o'clock hour and it's making it so those who were evacuated could not go home last night but now we are seeing people coming back into their homes but seeing the aftermath of this is heartbreaking and many are scared just thinking about the what ifs losing everything that you have you know and that's what's the case here this morning uh, we have people that have lost everything they had the fire marshal is here. We're told he has two investigators. They're trying to figure an exact cause, and we've been waiting for an update all morning from Moab police or Moab city. We're told we're supposed to get a press conference this morning. We're just waiting for a time, but coming up in our later shows, I'm going to have some great interviews of stories that you'll want to hear. One being of a woman who lost her home in this fire and another being of a woman who her home was saved thanks to firefighters literally standing at her front lawn, making it so that fire didn't get to her house. We'll have those stories for you later in our newscast at 5 and 9. For now, we're live in Moab. Kirsten Nunez, Fox 13 News, Utah.